Meet Star Blanket. Star Blanket lived to be about five years old. It flew away sometime in daycare. If you're out there, we still love you. Oh my, isn't that cute? This is Jackson's blanket covering up the cute booty. This is not Jackson. Jackson's six years old in this picture. Blanket's six years old right now. I decided to document Blanket because he's not gonna use it in a couple years and it's been with him his whole life. Be quiet. Hello, my name is Thomas Blanket. I am a Flemish weaver who lived in Bristol, England. I'm from the 14th century. Okay, got it? Everybody knows what a blanket is. It keeps you warm and stuff. You cover up your little tootsies and stuff and go to night night. Okay, but you don't know about me, all right? I pretty much pioneered this special fabric called blanket fabric, right? It's a heavily napped woolen weave. It's pioneered by me, all right? I was hired to do this, okay? Now, then later in life, I made the uh, Charlie D'Amelio blanket. It's nice, it's very popular, all right? And I also made the Fight Club blanket, okay? Now you know a little bit about me, all right? Deuces. Make sure you're wearing the Charlie D'Amelio mask in case she explodes in front of you. The word blanket is also used in William Shakespeare's King Lear where he talks about covering up his wiener. Blankets can also be used in stores to roll yourself up in a burrito. And a burrito. Meet the blanket octopus. Look at this. It's adorable. Looks like a colorful scarf floating around in the ocean. I don't know what I'd say if I came across you one day. If you want to, you can poop on a blanket. Or you can just get on Amazon and buy a poop emoji blanket. You can buy a cat doll woven tapestry blanket. You can get the Twitter bird pooping on Trump blanket. I like this one. You can buy a blanket that you pretty much wear. I want that. You can get a super tiny blanket for a mouse. You can get one for a little dog that looks kind of like Yoda. How about you don't? You can get one for a horse. Oh, look at this. This is cute. A cute little monkey in a blanket. There's also a lot of cool blanket stories. This one involves a kid jumping out of a building onto a blanket. A three-year-old boy was saved by a group of people who used a blanket to break his fall from the sixth floor apartment balcony, six yeah. floors up. Yeah, this is the video. It aired uh, on China State TV, and it captures the rescue effort here. Pretty scary stuff. You can see the toddler dangling from that balcony. They're clinging to life as the people below gather holding a blanket. Ooh. Oh my and there God. you saw that toddler fall mm. all that way down. Mm -hmm. Seconds later, he uh, was caught in that blanket. And if he had fallen even just a few seconds earlier, he would have died for sure. But instead, he's safe and sound. He was not hurt at all. Can you believe that? Police say the boy was left alone while his grandmother went out for groceries. You guys remember the story of Michael Jackson holding his son blanket out the window? This is the largest hand knit blanket non crochet in the world. This is from India in Dubai. This is from 2019. This giant blanket was made by Kanika Kapoor and her team. And it's going to be cut into several parts and sent to orphanages around the world. This is the largest crochet blanket in the world. It's made of 67 blankets for Nelson Mandela Day. It is 185,016 feet. This is a pretty cool fake fur blanket. Nowadays, you don't have to kill animals and you can buy nice expensive fake fur ones. This is a fox fur sand wolf Australian Geelong wolf throw. Check out this expensive blanket, over $10,000. This blanket is made of silk. Silk comes from the silk word. It's an animal. Now keep in mind, to make one pound of silk, it takes over 2,500 silkworms that are killed. Next up, we have a chinchilla blanket. Keep in mind, there's over three or 400 chinchillas that are killed to make one of these blankets. It looks like it was 35,000, it's on sale for 14,000. These animals are not shaved, they're killed. Look at this cute chinchilla. Would you want to hurt him? Well, hundreds of years ago, most people got blankets from using animal skins, killing animals. It's not necessary these days. Don't kill animals, they're our friends.